The great-grandson of evangelist Kenneth Hagan faces charges from a drive-by shooting in Broken Arrow, but he might get a plea deal with the help of former Tulsa District Attorney Tim Harris. It's a story first reported by our investigative partners at the Frontier. News on 6's Emory Bryan is live at the courthouse with the story. Emory? Well, the Frontier's Dylan Goforth first uh, reported Tim Harris's involvement helping the Hagan family negotiate with prosecutors. The drive-by shooting was early the morning of March 10th. Two dozen shots were fired in two passes by this house, but no one inside was hit. The surprise was one of three teenagers arrested, Blake Kenneth Hagan, great-grandson of the founder of Rama Bible Church. Now, as reported by the Frontier, a possible plea deal is in the works for all three, and Hagan has the former district attorney consulting on his behalf. Former DA and now candidate for Congress, Tim Harris, is working for Hagan's attorneys on the case. Harris told News on 6 he's not practicing criminal defense law now, but is assisting Hagan's lawyers with potential options and best case practices. Harris now has a consulting business in addition to running for Congress. The Frontier reports Hagan and two other defendants in the case, Save Price and Gordon McAuliffe, could each get a separate plea deal, but only Hagan has a former district attorney working on his case. The case was held over another month today at the request of Hagen's attorneys. The Frontier has more details on that story, and that's linked to this story in our News on 6 app.